got out there. Uh, you kind of did Cooper Consiglia with 2.0. You did the same thing he did. Um, it's neat to see you guys coming out of the bullpen like that. How neat, how fun is it to pitch with, with this team with so much depth in the bullpen? It seems like so much depth in the bullpen. Yeah, it's, it's really fun, you know. We, tr we trust everyone that we got. Whenever, you know, I hand the ball off to the next guy or whoever comes in after me or whoever I go in after, you know, they just they know their role, whether the starters just trying to eat innings and get us deep into the games and we turn over the pen. That's just kind of what we've been doing. We got the veterans starting and getting us deep into games and we turn over to the younger guys and it's, it's been working out pretty well. So I think, I think we'll stick with that for now and, you know, just see how it goes. Jacob talked about resiliency. You know, what's it been like, I guess, to be a part of that? And, you know, a lot of the younger guys having to step in and kind of get some bigger roles, you know, down the stretch here. Yeah, it's, uh, yeah, I mean, it's, it's really fun, though. You know, it's, at the end of the day, we're, we're playing baseball, we're having fun, and that's about all, all we can ask for. It, Division one baseball is it's pretty hard. So just going out there and just doing what we love is, is, is fun to do. Hey, because it is hard, right? And I think that's the kind of part that's lost in what has been so special in what you and your freshman class have done. I asked Jacob yesterday, what's so different about y'all's group? Because I asked him, do you guys ever check your pulse and realize that these moments are quite large? Like, what has allowed y'all to stay so calm, cool, and collected in those moments? I think I think we all, you know, we all came to here in summer together, and we all have just kind of gone through all of this together with injuries and everything. You know, it's kind of, it hasn't really been the next man up. It's just kind of been like, hey, like, it's your it's your turn. So we just uh, us giving, getting the opportunity and, you know, we're just going to go make the most of it every time we go out there. Smith, you guys have a lockdown. Do you think you have one of the better back end guys in the in the league? Yeah, I, I really, when it's the eighth, ninth inning, and you know you see Duden or Smith coming in, I, I I feel really confident. I know I know Coach does too, and I think it's it's helpful to have a good closer back there, good back end guys. Does it let you kind of leave, go free, knowing okay, if this thing goes awry, if I burn out, I got another guy behind me that can do it? Yeah, I guess you could say that. I just I'm gonna go out there, and when they tell me like, hey, you're done, then. Which hopefully like, put us in a good spot to win the game, and that's what that's what it was today. Where it was six to six, and then you know we scored three in the eighth, which was which was big. Pennington had a super clutch hit, and then they told me like, hey, like we're gonna go to Smith here. I, I felt super confident when it, knowing that like I did my job, and now it's uh, Smith's turn to do his job. How much confidence does the team does this team have right now going into the Charlotte? You know, with all the, the wins you guys have been able to pile up recently. Uh, I think we have, we have a good amount of confidence. You know, our, our lineup has been pretty solid all year. Just consistency has, has been big, and then. You know, our bullpen has gotten better throughout the year, even though we've had some injuries. And the starting pitcher, you know, Willitson went out early, which is which is uh, which hurt us. But starters have been really good, and you know, the bullpen has done a lot better recently, which which has been big for us. I mean, uh, over the course of the series, I mean, Wake Forest is going to get their hits, but the bullpen, just the pitching overall, really did a good job of stranding those the Demon Deacons on base. I believe it was nine for forty nine with runner, they hit with runners on, two for twenty six. You held them too with runners in scoring position. How big is it when, especially when you're going to be facing just a good team just about every night going forward? I mean, how big is it just be able to uh, limit that damage and keep those uh, opposing runners on base. Yeah, I mean, we, we've kind of treated every single one of these games like it's a postseason game. You know, we, we say, like, treat this game like it's your last, and we're just going to go – we're going to take one game at a time and treat it like, you know, it's our last, and we're just going to hopefully go out there and just do our job and win. Any more questions for Ryan? All right. Can I get a picture of him? 